Welcome to Brighton. This is a Backgammon News special report from the Brighton Breezy Backgammon Tournament here in Brighton. This is the first stop on the Bieber UK Tour, which takes in 12 tournaments throughout the year. This is the only one that's down here on the coast though. Bieber Backgammon is the longest running UK club and Brighton is its best attended tournament with often over a hundred players. I'm in the Old Ship Hotel in Brighton and I'm playing backgammon at the Bieber Brighton Breezy tournament. Hi, I'm Cecilia and I'm from Bristol. I'm here playing in the Brighton Breezy backgammon tournament. It's a knockout and there's a main flight in which you play 11 point matches and if you lose in your 11 point match you go into a consolation tournament in which you play a 7 point match. Um, I managed to win my first 11 point match but I lost my second 11 point match which means I'm now in the consolation tournament so my next match will be a 7 point match. Um, and I'm done for the day now so it's quite nice going into dinner and poker knowing that I've won and just playing again tomorrow. John Hurst of London attends this tournament every year and many consider it to be his tournament. He's won a fantastic four out of the last five tournaments. How will he do this year? I'm John Hurst. I've had a good run. I've won four out of the last five but I was knocked out in the first round today 11-0 so it won't be five out of six. I like Brighton um, and it's the, the only Bieber tournament that's fairly close to London. I live in London. Um, and there's a chance to meet old friends, some of them I only see once a year here at Brighton. So, um, yeah, it's one of my favourite tournaments. In the first round, I had the, well, in some ways you might regard the misfortune of playing John Hurst, who uh, is one of the very, very top uh, players here in Britain and who has won this tournament, I believe, four out of the last five years. So when I saw that draw, I didn't really rate my chances. However, the dice gods were with me and I managed to beat him 11-0, which uh, was a bit of a shock to him and a bit of a shock to me as well. Hannah Thorson qualified online and we'll be having a chat to her about how she finds Brighton. I'm Hannah, Hannah Thorson from Norway. So I want to qualify online. So I was supposed to have a party with a bunch of people and I had to ditch them to go play some backgammon and well, they were happy I won. I play in a local club in Oslo uh, every week and we also have a team tournament. Um, that's two is once a week and then I play some online wherever I find action and tournaments with value. So, John Hurst didn't manage to make it five out of six wins here at Brighton. He's only on four out of six. In the semi-finals, Dave Adlett got down to only seven seconds on his clock and then further down to three seconds. But he hung in there and he managed to beat John Wright to take a place in the final. In the other semi-final, Bob Young managed to beat John Batty and he plays Dave Ablett. In the final, it was tense as ever, but Bob Young managed to make it through and take the trophy. So, join us fortnightly for more backgammon news at youtube.com slash mindengagement. See you next time.